Hello, and welcome to the channel. Unfortunately, I've not had the time I'd have hoped to work on the video that I have planned for you all, but I'll aim to get this out soon. In the meantime, I wanted to provide an update to an unsolved case I covered on this channel just under a year ago. The murder of Billy Joe Jenkins is one of the UK's biggest unsolved cases in recent history. Her foster father, Sean Jenkins, was initially convicted of killing the then 13 year old in 1998 and spent six years in prison before being acquitted after a second retrial after a jury were unable to reach a verdict. Sean has always maintained his innocence, although his ex wife Lois firmly believed he was responsible for Billy Joe's death and she was instrumental during the investigation. If you want to know more about this case, I've left a link in the description to the original video I did covering it in more detail. As the years went on, the case grew cold and no fresh leads have since materialised. However, this could soon change as police announced on the 31st of January this year that they would be carrying out a forensic review of the evidence that was recovered at the time of the murder. One of those crucial pieces of evidence are the 148 blood spots that were found on Sean's clothes. These blood spots were naked to the human eye and were a major point of contention during his many trials. Police are hoping to uncover new leads using advancements in forensic science. At this moment in time, a murder is not being reinvestigated, but Sussex police stated that unsolved homicide cases are reviewed every two years to see if any new evidence could make reopening a case a viable option. We won't know more until the review has been completed, but I'll be keeping a close eye on the case and updating you when I know more. Fingers crossed police can uncover new evidence that will shed light on a case that has had them baffled for more than 25 years. Sadly, Billy Joe's birth mother, Deborah Barnett, died in 2018, and so should the case be reopened, she won't be around to potentially find out what happened to her daughter. For me personally, my hope is that enough new evidence can be found that would justify reopening the case so we can finally learn the truth as to what happened to Billy Joe all those years ago. Until next time, take care and goodbye for now.